Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be ranking every single Fortnite season all the way from the very beginning of Fortnite to the current season five and just giving my opinion on each season. So guys, remember, you guys can disagree with me, agree with me, but this is just my opinion. If you go ahead and enjoy today's video, be sure to drop a like down below and click subscribe if you're new to the channel. I really appreciate the support lately and use code ParkerDV in the item shop. It really means a lot. So guys, let's hop straight into it. Alrighty, we got Fortnite Season 1. It technically wasn't even called Season 1. It was just Fortnite Battle Royale. That's when it first came out. I did not play it. So because I didn't play it at this point, I'm probably going to rank it under like a pog because it was a pretty pogger season because it was obviously the start of the season, right? I'm not going to put it in God because I didn't actually play it. So it was a pretty solid season because I have looked back at it. So that's why. All right, season two. Let's see. This is the first battle pass ever in Fortnite with like the Black Knight. A lot of OG stuff, obviously, if you have this. Um, again, I did not play in season two. I started in season three. I'm going to go ahead and give this one also a poggers rating because, I mean, Fortnite season two is kind of when it started to blow up a lot. So that is why we're putting it there. Season 3, this is when I started, and I remember hearing about Fortnite, I was in 8th grade at the point, and all my friends were talking about it, I'm like, what is this game, and I literally came home after school one day, downloaded it, hopped onto it, and oh my god, I fell in love with it right away, as you guys can tell, because I still play the game, right? So, I'm going to go ahead and give this one, I'd say also another Poggers, you know? I know <laughs> I've ranked all three of them at the same, but trust me. They're not all going to be poggers seasons. All right. So that was an awesome season. I played about halfway through the season and then season four hit. Oh my God. It is a God season. That is because there was the first ever event, which was the rocket event, which was super hype. Everyone was really excited about that. And then Dusty Divot. When Dusty Depot got hit by the meteor, we got the huge crater in the form of Dusty Divot. And it was such an awesome location. I remember when there were no trees in it at all. It was completely bare with just like the, the space station or whatever in the middle. And oh my god, I loved landing here so much. Picking up the hop rocks. So many good memories. This was such a good season. Oh my god, I wish I could go back. Alright, season 5. This is when we got the first large change on the map with Paradise Palms and the whole desert area. I'd say this season was also a pogger season. It was really good. I loved the whole desert added spot. And there were a ton of map changes throughout the whole season. It was super solid. Love the feel of the season. And yeah, I, like I said, I wish I could go back to the old map in these seasons so much. So yeah, really good season. Season six, I'd say it was okay. It wasn't my favorite because, you know, it was the dark theme, which I did like for Halloween and stuff. And that's when Kevin the Cube actually lifted up loot lake island which was pretty cool and that's when the first fort nightmares happened was in season six that was a pretty good season but there were a couple things i didn't like about it just the battle pass wasn't my favorite as well um i don't know i just didn't really like the season as much as season like four and five so that's why i'm gonna put it under okay season seven for me was also a god season because that was when the snow area was added frosty flights oh my god I probably landed there 80% of all my matches in that entire season. It was such a fun spot. Planes were introduced. The Infinity Blade, which was vaulted very quickly, I'd say like in one day. Um, this season was so awesome. I remember playing with my brother every day. We had such a good time. Battle Pass was really solid. And I love the upgradable skins, like the Lynx, super cool skin. And the whole Christmas theme, of course. Gotta remember that. That was also why it was such a good season. Moving on, season eight. Season eight was okay for me. Um, the battle pass skins were pretty underwhelming, to be honest. Especially the tier 100 was probably the worst tier 100 skin we've ever gotten. Um, the volcano was super cool. I did love that addition to the map. And of course, that's when the monster versus robot event did occur. I believe it was at season eight. It could have been season nine. No, I think it was at the end of season eight. So that event was really cool. By far the best event Fortnite has ever done. So I would rank it a little bit higher, but just, I don't know. The battle pass was pretty bad. Um, also like the pirate ship area was really cool though. However, I did enjoy landing there a lot. So it was a pretty solid season, but definitely not the best. 
season nine i would say it's not bad because that's when we got the whole futuristic vibe tilted towers was replaced with the neo tilted which to be honest i didn't really care for that much tilted towers alone you know was just so much better just you know all the memories from it it was really good and just the feel of the neo tilted was kind of weird everything was like rearranged and we did get the wind turbines which was really good movement around the map i did like that aspect of it and also retail row was replaced i think it was called mega mall or something like that so it was a not bad season that's why we're putting it under not bad of course but wasn't my favorite futuristic vibes were kind of cool but not my favorite season x you already know it's trash mechs ruined the game at that point um i know they added the mechs because they felt a lot of players couldn't just you know they weren't getting good at the game so they wanted to give those players an opportunity to like i don't know advance at the game but i feel like the mechs were not a good way to do that because they were just so overpowered and even like the best players couldn't even fight off a mech so the mechs for me really just ruined it and the fact that a lot of the battle pass skins were kind of like just remade from like season four which was kind of weird so yeah i don't i don't know what to think about that season but it, it was pretty bad fortnite chapter two season one oh my god not bad or trash okay i'm gonna put it under not bad because we did get a brand new map that's why i'm putting it there but the whole feel of the season it lasted ages i mean it felt like a whole year to be honest um there were no map changes after of course the new map no like updates it was just so slow there was a huge spike of players at the beginning because of the new map and then it was just a flat line it was just so boring i don't know it, it was not the best season for sure it was really cool though to get the brand new map but obviously i wish we could go back on the old map right now but you know it is what it is so yeah that wasn't a bad season but it definitely was not the best chapter two season two this is gonna be Oh my god, this is close. It's either going to be a Poggers or a God. You know, we're going to put it in Poggers because I love the idea of the whole spy theme with Midas and all the mythic items that you can, you know, take the bosses down and gather them. And then the vaults, it was just so much fun. I actually really wish I could go back to this season. I love the whole layout of everything. A lot of new map changes. Super awesome season. Yeah, so we're putting it under Poggers for sure. Season 3 of Chapter 2. I would say it was okay. Um, the whole flooding of the map was pretty cool. It was a, you know, a massive change to the map. And I did like how, you know, the, the flood dropped over time and brought back the original map. But the thing about it was just, the sharks are not my favorite. They would always, like, pull up behind you and just attack you and, you know, crush all your builds. They would literally fly. The sharks fly. Like, come on. It's kind of weird. Um, I did like the secret skin of Aquaman. Battle Pass skins were pretty cool i mean there were a couple that i didn't really care for um there were a lot of new map changes which was cool but obviously this whole season was themed for water and i i did like it It was pretty cool but it definitely wasn't up on the top of the list chapter two season four this was also going to be a god season i love the marvel theme that's not why it's a god season it's because just how the updates rolled out how the map changes occurred and the whole hype over you know the new heroes coming and i love how the battle pass was obviously marvel you could actually be those skins and then a lot of them have upgradable styles which is super cool the whole stark industries point on the map was super cool it wasn't added in right at the start of the season it was kind of like towards the middle we got like the the stark industries like those generators that were creating the huge circle and people were like wondering what's going to happen over there and of course it was replaced with stark industries which is a really interesting thought because it was literally a chunk of land from some other world placed onto the Fortnite map. So super high cliffs. Trust me, I fell off those cliffs a lot of times. But super cool area. Obviously the most popular spot on the map during that season. The loot pool was super cool. The Stark rifles were really good. I mean, they were awesome. Super cool weapon because of the fact that when you aim down sights, it does more damage, but the fire rate is slower. And then when you hit fire, it does faster fire rate, but less damage. Just super cool thought. I really loved it. Of course, we got the pump shotguns. Yeah, I love season four. And of course, the Galactus event at the end was so hype. It was really well done. The first event where we actually got to like interact, I believe, besides the um the drum gun event, like the unvaulting event way back in season six, seven. I don't even remember, but I loved how you could play the game like it was an arcade. Super cool. Season was definitely a god season. 
season five, the current season of Fortnite. So I'm not gonna rank it super high or super low. That's why I'm gonna put it right in the middle because the season's not over yet. So, so far season five has been pretty good. I love the whole sand area on the middle of the map. And what's funny about this is actually season five of chapter one is when we got introduced to the desert area. Same thing for chapter two, season five. My favorite thing probably about the season so far is of course the Mandalorian. I am a huge Star Wars fan of, and of course of the Mandalorian. I've watched every single episode of the show. I'm probably gonna start watching it again because oh my God, it's an awesome show. I love the battle pass, it's pretty solid. And I really do like the idea of Jonesy actually bringing other heroes from the outside world into the map, which is really cool because they're trying to protect something or keep us from like figuring out a way to exit the map. I'm not really sure exactly which one it is, but all the collaborations have been really cool. And I mean, they're like happening around like every month or no less than that. It's like every few weeks, to be honest, you know, we had the walking dead. We had the master chief. We just had GI Joe and I'm missing a whole lot more, but the collaborations have been awesome super cool so this season is really solid i might actually move it up one but you know just for now since the season's not over we have to like i think march 20th or something until it's finally over i could change it in the future but pretty solid season love the battle pass so that is my tier list for all of the fortnite seasons let me know if you guys agree or disagree with any of them let me know in the comments what you would change or keep so i think my favorite season overall was gotta be season four of chapter one it was just such an awesome season i really wish i could go back there that is my definite favorite season of all and of course worst season was season x because of the mechs it just ruined the game so thank you guys so much for watching this video i really appreciate you sticking around to the end i'm trying to get these watch hours in so i can get monetized on youtube and trust me it is not easy so you guys being here watching to the end really means a lot to me and it really supports me getting me slightly closer to that 4,000 mark so guys thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys later peace